What's up guys, it's your boy Samir and I'm back with another cool video. MIUI 8, which has been recently released, is one of the most refined versions of MIUI and I had done a couple of videos on that regarding how to install MIUI 8 and what are the newly added features. So you can check out my full review of MIUI 8 on my website or just click the above link. MIUI 8 has so many hidden tricks by which a normal user is not aware of. These hidden tricks will basically add a pinch of twist to your user experience and let you understand this custom OS in a better way. So basically in this video, I'm gonna show you 8 hidden tricks of MIUI 8 which you are not aware of. So without any further ado, let's get started. First, App Invisible. If you want to keep some of your apps private from others so that they couldn't see which apps do you have, then this trick is going to be really useful. Just go to the Better Feature option which is present in the additional settings. There you will find an option called App Invisible through which you can hide any app which you want and you can also unhide by doing the same. Second, QR Code Wi-Fi Sharing. Imagine you are at your friend's house and desperately need to hook up your phone to a Wi-Fi network. He hands you the password which is something like this. So good luck typing those letters and numbers in and yeah it is definitely going to irritate you. But in MIUI there is an easier way to share your Wi-Fi network via QR code. Plus all Xiaomi devices have a QR reader integrated into the camera app. So you can simply activate the camera, point it at the QR code and you are connected. It's as simple as that. Third, instant flashlight. It's highly unlikely possible that a blackout will occur in your daily day-to-day -day life and your smartphone could be used as a flashlight but for that you have to fiddle through pages and apps to activate it. But did you know in MIUI you can activate the flash from the lock screen? Just press and hold the home button to activate it. To switch off the light, click on the power button. So practically this old school method could be a time saver. Fourth, Private Messaging and Files Unlike other messaging and file manager app, MIUI's private messaging and hidden file feature is integrated within its default app. You can set a password to prevent unauthorized access. To activate, open the respective app and continue to swipe the screen downwards till the private section appears. Now from this section you can easily access all the hidden files and messages. Fifth, two finger notification swipe. Now this is something new to MIUI. This basically works when you get a notification from a certain app. And if you want to read that message without opening it, then just swipe two fingers over that to expand the notification. You can also reply directly from here. Sixth, shake it to arrange. I'm sure that you all have went through this situation when there are lots of apps on your home screen which are randomly arranged and to arrange them one by one could be really irritating. So here is our new trick. By using this, you can arrange your apps with few shakes just like this. Isn't it cool? 7th, tap and hold notification toggle. If you know that in MIUI 8 notification panel gets a new shade in which toggles are arranged in a very different manner. But did you know that we can directly access the full setting page of a particular toggle by just pressing and holding it for few seconds. This will basically save some of your taps and get the work done in an easy way. 8th, in detail device info. At last, there is a hidden option in the setting by which you can access the detailed information of your device. Just go to about phone and tap the internal memory few times to open it. Now you can access all the detailed information about phone, battery and Wi-Fi. You can also track your usage statistics that what are the apps you are using most and what is the exact usage time. So guys, these are the 8 hidden tricks in MIUI 8 which could be useful for you. If I had missed any trick, then let me know that in the comment section. So guys, that's all for today. If you find this video helpful, do hit the like, share and subscribe button for more future updates. See you guys in my next video.